How you doing everyone? Scott back again and not for my promised CD update but for the unboxing of the new Overkill box set, um, the Atlantic years. Got this in today, I think it was released on the 3rd so um, that's not too bad. Um, took a few days to get here from EMP but it's finally in and uh, I think this covers the first I want to say the first six albums, it might be the first seven, I can't remember, but we can open this up and find out together. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to open this up. So bear with me. Should be pretty easy and it's always pretty well packed from EMP. First box open. Next box. Oh, we've got something here. A £5.55 discount voucher. I mean, they don't make it. Super easy. Right, we're in. Here we go. And this is it. So, the first six albums. It's not the first six albums. It's the first six albums on Atlantic or the Atlantic years, as you can see. Um, kind of a black on black cover, so you can't really see much. Hype sticker. So Atlantic Years, 1986 to 1994, six album box set, um, back on vinyl after being out of print for many years, half speed mastered for dynamic range and pressed on 180 gram vinyl. So this looks pretty decent, so I'll just crack the selfie in on this. Uh, this was actually delayed. It was supposed to come out in, I think, October or maybe November, but it got pushed back. A lot of the pre-orders I've made this year have all been pushed back. Um, I'm still waiting on some that were supposed to be released three months ago, so um, they're all coming in delayed. So here we go, try and preserve these stickers. And there we go, that is the front. With the logo and here is the back detailing what is in this box set so here we go I'll just pull them all out there's nothing fancy really about this um, although the box could have been a bit smaller because it's all bent bent in but anyway let's see first off we have Taking over. Um, insert the lyrics. Now, first impressions. I think this is. I think these are all on black vinyl. There we go. First impressions. It feels a little cheap. Quite light. Quite. Quite rattly. Um, this is actually one I do have the OG of, but um, when you see an overkill box set coming out, you can't really ignore it. So that is the first one. And next up we have Under the Influence. Again, it feels a bit cheap to be honest. I mean, for a box set, it wasn't it wasn't super expensive. It was a it was a pretty good price, so I wasn't expecting, you know, the best of the best. These are really, um, I think these have really been released because they're so hard to get the the originals off. And I mean, it's about time people had the kind of um, the opportunity to grab these albums on vinyl. So anyway, another one I have on uh, OG, but still great to have 
um, a brand new copy of. Uh, next up, and I think this will be the album that will be getting a lot of people's attention um, because it's so hard to get its years of decay. Um, an absolute classic. And if you want to grab that on vinyl now, it's an absolute nightmare. Um, I mean, I think the, the cheapest I've, I've seen this go for in the last year is about 70 quid. And, it, you know, it's good, but come on. Um, again, lyrics and a photo of the band. Pretty sure this will be black vinyl. Yeah, they're all black vinyl. So I'll not go crazy with the detail. Um, nothing else in there. But yeah, I think this is the, the big draw for this box set. Uh, next up is Horoscope. Um, and I don't actually have this. So this was the kind of draw for me as well. Um, Horoscope, this was actually the first Overkill album I picked up um, on vinyl. I managed to find this OG press really, really cheap. Quite lucky actually, but again, great to have probably like the play copy. Um, obviously don't know what these sound like just opened, so hopefully these are, um, the recordings are good, but I, I don't see why they wouldn't be. So Horoscope, um, I Hear Black, another one quite hard to get, another draw for this box set. And all you get is lyrics. Black vinyl. Again, I mean, I'm not sure about the, the covers. They look a little bit. Maybe not. Maybe it's just this one. But then again, I don't really know how clear this cover is to start with. But the logo looks a little bit bored from where I am. Um, but anyway, I hear black. And then, last but not least, WFO, which is an album I've never heard. So, um, don't own it, never heard it, glad to have it in the collection. So there we go. That's pretty much it. Um, like I said, I wasn't expecting massive things. Although when you when you hear of these box sets coming out, you kind of wish they would make a bit of a, a fuss with them. Um, like Creator did with Under the Guillotine. Um, they, that was like a really well put together package with a cassette, CD, DVD, you know, USB stick, uh, a big hardback book inside. Um, you know, they, they kind of made a fuss of the discography. This is kind of like on your more basic um, level. But at the same time, although the creator box set would be like a really good collector's piece. A lot of people will just buy this precisely for the music. This is like exactly what they want. They're not bothered about, you know, bits and pieces. Um, they're really here for the music. So um, so I think this, this goes for about £110 or something like that. So it's not... Or it was when I bought it. I, I, I pre-ordered it. So um, it's not massively expensive for a box set. And just to recap... Uh, taking over uh, Under the Influence Years of Decay Horoscope I Hear Black and WFO So that is it, there's no fancy bits and pieces um, but I thought I would just take this time to show you guys the box set. First impressions though, it's ba it is basic. Um, as you can see the box is almost a little too big for what's in there. So I, I actually might pack, I might pack that out with um, a stiffener or something in there because it's, it's kind of bent in. Um, but for your money, it's well worth it um, because some people obviously aren't as lucky um, finding these OG presses and sometimes when you do find them, you know, you're, you're paying quite a lot for them now. So um, I would recommend it, but don't expect anything too, too fancy. Um, but when you add it all together, six albums for £110, that's pretty decent. So there we go. Overkill. 
the Atlantic years, 1986 to 1994. That is the box set. Hope you guys enjoyed that. That was a quick run through, but um, not really much to show. Um, but like I said, a great way to just grab all these albums in a winner if you're missing some of these or all of them from your collection. So there we go. Hope you enjoyed that. You can let me know what you think in the comments. If you're going to buy it, you've bought it, um, why maybe you didn't buy it. I'd uh, be interested to hear your opinions. So you can let me know and I'll see you guys hopefully very soon for my CD update. But who knows when that could be. Hopefully in the next week. But we'll see how that goes. Anyway, see you guys soon. Cheers.